Hi guys, welcome back. Uh, we got a new rootless launcher which is called as a launcher launcher. So in one of my previous videos, I did have shown you uh, a launcher from a Reddit developer called as a Amarjali who posted on there. And uh, when you install that, you're going to get something like that. You know, this is what is there. So uh, it was pretty much all rootless launcher. You can install it on many places. And to get this, uh, you know, uh, specific feature like this app shortcut, you're gonna need a specific Android version, say 7.1.1. But uh, this one looks fine to me. They got a new launcher, as a launcher, launcher. So this launcher, you need to install it via APK. So check the description, you will have it. So I have installed right now on my Nexus 6 here, you can see. And uh, it looks pretty cool here, but uh, you got some more option. But again, guys, some things are still not working. For example, as you can see here, let me just increase the brightness here too. So this is the weather widget, you can see the original Google Pixel launcher is showing you as a customizable, you know, some kind of, uh, uh, you can see interface is a little bit different. It shows a little bit of animation here, like it is wind is blowing or it is raining. So it shows all the stuff here. But this one here, it just simple shows date and time. And also you can see when you click on here, this thing is not working. And if I click here on my pixel, it is showing you exactly the weather. So this thing is not working. Even though Google search will work, but uh, this one here is won't work. So along with that, uh, if you just go inside, you have a lot of customization options. So this is nice actually. You got the categories here. If you go inside, you can uh, browse any icon pack, whatever you want. So these two are currently I'm using. So you can take any icon pack, whatever you want. And some more colors of the icon labels here, handed person, number of icons, rows that you want. You can change according to your screen size and description. So a lot of people have complained like this thing is not working. I got four rows, five rows. So you can change all things here. Icon scale, you can change that. Coming back, pixel style. And you have options to, you know, uh, you can enable the show voice search button. So you can see once you do that, you don't get this separate voice button. So that is actually nice kind of, but still the weather thing is not working. I won't recommend that. And you can use white search bar and uh, you can also enable this uh, pixel like So by default, it shows you a little bit of a square this one here, but once you use those things, and since this is APK, it's a little bit, uh, you know, laggy also. But this thing, you can see now this uh, rounded icons are being removed. Here on the behavior, you have something here, haptic feedback, enable, and save scroll state, uh, hidden application, home button opens, app draw. So kind of things are there. So, and uh, also I did found a little bug here. Let me show you on my Nexus 6 screen. Once I install them, even though I selected here, like, uh, show all the rounded icons as much as possible so it is not taking for many of the applications and still it shows you can see a little bit lag is there when it's installed but anyway guys this is apk so you have to deal with it you can see I don't, now i have selected this rounded one so it's not showing me exactly the circle on all the applications play store is rounded but this one here you can see the messages and the call is still on the square one. so now let's go and check out see quick uh, app shortcuts are working or not so good to go so these are the options you are getting my apps and my apps so and if you go inside let's see how are the youtube here so this one here you are seeing good options there also let's give a try for the twitter and here you go this one here again twitter stuff got the safe scan qr code right you can make a quick shortcut here so you guys know it came so you can directly just make a new tweet from here new message from here so pretty much this thing is working so guys we have a stall on the galaxy s8 running the android nuga 7.0 now let's give a try this uh, quick app shortcut so you can see this thing is not working so this feature need android nougat 7.1.1 otherwise it won't work so you can see we can easily able to stall it on the one plus five also and uh, there you go so guys, as you can see, this is your new launcher and enjoy it on all the devices running here. And uh, you can install it, I guess, on all the devices, but some feature need a specific Android version, say 7.1.1. As you can see, this thing is not working on my smartphone. So, thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Have a great day.